I see now. They wanted to play a cruel prank on us, didn't they? To choose you for me. For this little game of theirs. I don't even know why I came. It wasn't worth it anyways. Whatever. Get in the closet. I'll be right behind you. What a stroke of bad luck for the both of us. You happen to be the one picks for me. And I happen to be the one that you're going in here with. <laughs> Turns out you're stuck in here with me for seven minutes. Starting, I don't know. They must have started the timer by now. So, the clock's probably ticking. Look... I don't like this as much as you don't, so. I don't think this is worth doing. <sighs> Unfortunately, you're probably right. They'd be a little disappointed if, uh, they couldn't get any spicy details from us. <sighs> Fuck. Well. If we have to do it, to keep up this little charade, I suppose we might as well fake it good. What? You weren't expecting us to actually do something, were you? <sighs> Can't believe you. Seriously? You with me? In this cramped closet? Actually doing something, knowing our history. Sounds awfully dumb of you, if I'm being honest. Yeah, why would I ever want to do something with you? <laughs> Keep it down. I don't want them to hear us arguing. They wouldn't like that very much. <sighs> yeah, it's not that big of a deal, but I'd rather they not mess with me any more than they already have. So, we'll play this stupid charade of theirs. We can kiss and we can touch, but I'm not doing anything past that. Besides, surely there's only like five minutes left anyways. Fine, just put your back against the wall, or I'll make you. <laughs> just like that. Now, I'll lean in just a little bit. You smell pretty good. All things considered. <laughs> you don't taste as good as you smell, that's for sure. But I guess I can't complain. Uh, more? You're a little greedy for it, aren't you? What makes you want it so bad? Is it because of me, or is it just because you want to do something with your life? Finally be a rebel. You were invited once to a house party, now you think you're hot shit, huh? Well, props to you for going through with it at least. <laughs> yeah. 
It feels worse when you're fighting against me like that. So don't do it. Besides, I can feel you giving way to my knee. You're too blatant. Spreading your legs like that. It's almost like you want me. Just shut up and kiss me. Feels like we've been in here for hours. Maybe that's what happens when it's uncomfortable. Tension never leads to a good time. At least, the kind of tension we're holding against each other. And yet, I can feel a different kind of tension building in you. It's a little too obvious. You're practically straddling my knee by now. I won't lie. I'm a little tempted. But I don't think we have the time for that. Make do with the time we have. I guess it's time we go, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, they're knocking on the door, so... I can imagine they won't let us stay in here for much longer. Listen. I'll go up to one of the empty rooms. And if you follow me... Well, I won't stop you. You'll just have to see what lies up there, won't you? Bye-bye now. <laughs>